Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Colin McRae Dirt. Today is episode number 10. If you want to keep up to date with all going on in this series, then make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And make sure to check out the description for our social links. We've got Twitter, Instagram, and Discord. But hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video. We are next going to be at France at the Circuit de Dux. Let's go. All right, here we go, round two. We are at our car's home ground in France. France, eh? And look at that overtake there. Right up the inside. That is awesome. Just stopping right in front of the cars as well. Awesome. Go, go, go. Nice. Awesome. Right, we've got one more lap. Let's do this. This is crazy fast, this car. A lot of the cars in this game do feel much faster than uh, the later games. The later games felt a little bit slower. One minute, 36.44. That's a very quick race. I'll take that though. Another first place. I think for the next race, we could technically come uh, fourth and still win. Um, but the next place is going to be... I can't actually read that. It's going to be Knock Hill at the United Kingdom. Let's do this. Here we go. What are you doing? Get out of my way. Lancia Stratos is time. No, we're not in the Lancia. We're in the Renault. I was looking at a Lancia Stratos. <laughs> we're... It's our time to shine. It would have just made more sense to say in the word hour. Oh well. We're very quick in this. Uh... Maxi 5 Turbo. This is definitely the quickest car we've driven yet, sort of round tracks. Round Rallycross. I much prefer driving this to some of the other cars, that's for sure. Awesome. Go, go, go. Nice. Uh, 420. This is a very good race here. Come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Nearly done. And across the line. Very nice. I like how each car we've driven, we've literally driven for only like 10 miles at the most. It's a little bit crazy. And the amount of money you earn from each event is ridiculous as well. Like this event 
Come in first now, we're gonna earn ourselves like a hundred and fifty thousand or something like that, I think. Lucky number seven, the next level. Go for oh, a hundred and twenty five thousand, thank you. And that is it. Tier number seven has been unlocked. We've got some very interesting um, events unlocked now. I'm going to save our content. And now what we're going to do is we're going to move over to Rally Raid T1. We're going to be going to Jamal Valley and then to Lower Ate Lake. So let's start with this. And we have a choice of two vehicles. Three vehicles. Oh, we got another vehicle that's just been unlocked. This one. Oh, okay. Do you have a choice of the X3, the Mitsubishi Montero, or the Turag? Uh, this is a choice and a half for me. I think we'll take the X3 for now. Uh, and then we'll get the Mitsubishi. We'll leave the Turag out for this uh, walkthrough, I think. Yep, let's purchase the X3 for £350,000. That's more expensive than a bus. Yeah. Seems a bit off. And uh, let's get the Continental livery as well. Because that's a decent livery. I quite like Continental. There we go. And we're going to Jamul Valley for the first race with the X3. Let's do this. Alright, here we go. We're at the valley. And we are driving the X3. And I think this is the uh, off-road track with the hairpin turns. With the really cool turns and tracks and all that stuff. And left four. Get out of the way! I'm coming through my orange beamer. And right three and Zip right Zima in my orange beamer. Left okay, five, that wasn't great. Left two. Nice. Into right three and crest and long crest. This does feel very big, um, and it is a little bit more difficult to turn than the other Rally Range vehicles, especially the Nissan. The Nissan was really agile. That jump though was crazy. There's our Lord Colin McRae up ahead. Into left two. One hundred. Nice. Right four, left four, right Going through narrow sections now. 60, left 3 into right 1. Right, hairpins, hairpins, hairpins. And Come on. Two, long. Into right 2. Can we uh, overtake him? Four, right three, Can we get him now? Three. Oh. And right 4. Ah, oh, we got him just. Left three, tightens it to right two, left two. These are going to be two pretty long races now. 150, right one. Go, 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 go. Eighty, left two. These events are becoming like proper event lengths now. And right two. Sixty, right four. Nice. 60, right four into left one. And right one. And left one. 150. Perfect. Right one and left two. Into right three and right two. Nice. Sixty. Left three and right Come on. three. Open. We're doing all right. We're doing all right today. One fifty. And here we go. Come in. Finishing point, off right the five. first lap. Three minutes. And left four over Ooh, crest and right Just four. under. That was awesome. We actually jumped four. over the side barriers there. And right three and right three. One hundred. Left five. Also. Awesome. Left two. Into 
right three and crest and long crest. 150. Crest, 80, right two. Oh, slow down, slow down. Okay, that wasn't great. Stealing the victory from me that easily. Right two. Sixty, right four. Nice. Sixty, right four into left one. And right one. And left one. Go, go, go. Come on. One fifty. Right one and left two. Eighty. Left three into right three and right nice. two. Nice. Sixty. Left three and right three opens. One fifty. Coming up to the final stretch. Crest time. Let's do this. Right five. And across the line, 558.59. That's very good. That was uh, super fast. Awesome. Not a personal best though. I think the personal best is held by um, the Nissan, or it would be for the Nissan. Right, USA. Very nice. We're going to Lower Ate Lake for this next one, so let's do this. Alright, here we go. We're on to the next race with the BMW X3. 150, left 5, Titans 4. We got two laps of the lake track. This one is actually pretty fun, this track. And right 4, and left 4, and right here We go, nice, nice, nice. Right, we've taken the lead very early on before the first 30 seconds. Perfect. Trying to get as much speed through these corners as possible. Left six and right four long. Most of it is trying to keep the speed over jump. Very nice. And left four and left five into right three. Sixty, right five. Slow. Okay, there we go. One hundred, right three, left four, right five. Caution, crest, left three. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, there we go. Right four, Titans three, and left three. And right four. 
right five into left five. 150, jump and crest left five. No, 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 no. Oh, that was crazy. That was close to rolling over. 80, right three. Perfect. 60, left five and right three. Left four Titans. One fifty, right three. Awesome. And left oh. four and right five. Perfect. Eighty narrows and jump and time point. All right, time point going on to the second lap. Titans four. A little bit of a shorter lap, this one. Oh, oh. Yeah. I was expecting it to kick me off. I was not expecting the game to let me get away with that. And it didn't. Rest, left four, very long, and right Quite far two. behind me at the moment, the other cars. We've only got uh, two more events of tier six after this race. I think the next one's got three races and I'm not sure what the final one is. Actually, no, I know what the final one is. It's, um, ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba what's it called again? Hill Climb Unlimited. That one's gonna be fun because I think it unlocks more cars and we'll have a chance at other Hill Climb cars. The other ones are super powerful. That one that we just drove, the uh, FTO, nothing 100, right compared three, to this, left four, what's about to right come up. Five. Oh, really risky through there. 200. And we've spun. It's never ideal to spin your car. As long as you can get back on track, it's fine. I'd say as long as you're still having fun, it's fine. But right four, ah, Titans three and different left people have three. different opinions. And right five into left five. Nice. One hundred and fifty jump and crest left five. Perfect. And left four Titans. I'm about to sneeze. One fifty, right three. Yeah, <laughs> Jesus. And left four and right five. Ow, that really hurt. <laughs> Here we go, then. Come on. And jump and time point. And across the line. God, that was like an explosion at the back of my nose. Great stuff. Imagine a bomb going off in your nose. That's what it felt like. <laughs> but that is it. 20 points for that. That is the raid races done. Man, no one can catch you. Right, let's get our money. A hundred thousand pounds, is that it? Oh, okay. Thanks for that. Would have liked a little bit more. Uh, but next up is Crossover Classic. We haven't done Crossover for a while, so this is going to be fun. Your work here is done. Uh, one thing I do want to check. Um, how much money do we need? 350,000. Uh, so yes, I do not have enough money to buy a new car, so we're going to be sticking with uh, the Celica for now. We can't buy the Impreza, unfortunately. Um, can we get a different design then? Because we have driven this quite a lot. Uh, Recaro? Let's get that one. 
We'll get the Recaro Racing design. And then we have a choice of two very nice Pikes Peak car for the next one. But first off, Numata Raceway for the first of the crossover races. Right, here we go. We are at the raceway with the Recaro Celica. Looks very nice, actually, this color. And off we go. <laughs> this is... Oh, we're already uh, going off-road. Probably not recommended. Awesome. Looking forward to getting some very decent times with this. Oh, oof. Bit of contact through there. And through you go. Very nice. Come on. Perfect. And here is the finish line. We were miles ahead. 7.85 seconds. Ah, uh, all that champagne. Very nice. And that was our personal best as well. 1 minute 4.47. So that is the quarterfinals done. What was the times looking like? So you had a 108, 110, 104. Uh, and 111. Um, slowest card was actually in semi-final 2. Interesting. So I'm going up against the guy who did a 1 minute 10. Should be easy. Should be easy. Alright, here we go. We are here for the second race. Let's see how well this goes. Can we get a faster time? Hopefully. We are going pretty quick off the start though. I would have liked to have done two laps, probably, for each of these races. Would have made it a little bit longer, a little more exciting, but it's alright. It's not the end of the world. Over the jump we go. Okay, yeah, we lost a lot of time there. Massive crash into the wall. Right, and here we go. Holy shite, okay. 102.42. That was definitely a personal best. That was really good. Right, and the person we're going against did a 109.75, so our final should be fairly easy then. Hang on, have we... Every single race, our quarterfinal, our semi-final, and our final, we've gone against the Celine. Actually, all of them have been mixed up. Except for the first two. Alright, here we go. It's our time to shine. Let's see if we can post an even faster time. If we don't crash, we could do it. good that's good so far I feel like that first section we've definitely gotten time up on our last run big time up over the jump no crash there as well a little bit of a slow down there might have been a bit too uh, slow through there 56, 57, 58, 59, a minute, a minute 1.51, that was, so, that was so much quicker, 
That was amazing. That was really good. Really good. 101.51. I think that was over a second faster as well. Because the last one was like 102.81, I think. Somewhere around there. So that was a very decent run. Man, no one can catch you. You're a winner. No one could catch you. Right, and that is that done. Saving content. We've got one more race left of... What tier is this? Tier 6. We've got one more race left. And we have a choice of two cars. Either the Peugeot 405 T16 Pikes Peak, which is a very nice car, or the Audi Quattro S1 Pikes Peak. Now, these are both very good cars. One is much longer than the other. Personally, I prefer a longer car because it's a little bit more easier to control. So, I'm going to go for the 405 T16 for this one. Yes, I would like to buy. And if there's a nice livery, we may end up buying that as well. Uh, there's bright green. We're going for it. <laughs> I mean, we haven't driven a bright green car in this game yet. So, uh, we're going for it. And we are going to Pikes Peak Short C. So, this is actually going to be a very quick race. So, let's do this. Alright, here we go. Look at the size of the wing on this thing. Actually, hang on. Oh, a little bit too quick. Um, this is after that first Pikes Peak Unlimited. This is actually the section after it. Short C. So there is even more that we haven't done yet. I remember this on the Crew 2. This exact stretch. Oh, careful. 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 How many times do I have to say careful before I actually understand what that word means myself? One second ahead. Jeff Irvine in third. Interesting. Going up the Pikes Peak Mountain right now. Oh, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch. He's gone off, he's gone off. He's back on. Oh, that's a massive mountain. That would have, like, killed you. Easy. Oh, look at that. 0 0.08 seconds. We can, if we keep it steady, get a dub from this. I would love to see one of these events being a full run of Pikes Peak. Pikes Peak's quite long. It's a fairly long track. It's like the Nürburgring, but if it only went in one direction and that being up and sideways. This is very good. This is a very steep section, actually. Oh, and I remember this area. This is getting up to the top section where uh, Ken Block did his Gymkhana. I think he's done a Gymkhana on a Pikes Peak before. Pretty sure. Oh no! This looks like it's gonna need an ambulance. Oh no! Right at the end. Okay, let's restart. <laughs> I saw the tight corner. Ah. Oh. Completely messed that up. Big time. Call 911. This looks like it's going to need an ambulance. But that is actually quite understandable. It is an unrecoverable position, technically, if you went over. 
I'm pretty sure if you went down there, you'd be able to recover and start the race again. Or continue from where you were. But, yeah, down there, definitely unrecoverable. That was pretty cool as well, that little hop. Funny hop. We're actually behind now. That crash did set us back quite a bit. Come on, you can do this. Maybe the Peugeot was a wrong idea. A bit late now, you can't really change it. Nice. Okay, we've got the lead back again. Go, 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 go. Come on. Okay, don't go down the edge, please. Awesome. Oh yeah, and also don't uh, crash off the side of the mountain either. I really don't want to do it for a third time. Because that will be embarrassing. There we go, we got the distance now. It's very steep. A random train there. I'm pretty sure that's a train. Is it? Yeah, it looks a bit train like. Okay. Here is the corner coming up in a minute. Hey, hey we did it. We made it round. I think that is definitely the top of Pike's Peak at that point. Yeah, you've won the championship, dude. Nice driving. There we go, we did it. On the second attempt. That is a quick car though. 247. These cars are unbelievably unbelievably quick. How sweet it is. Top of the pile. A hundred thousand pounds. Very nice. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. Make sure to check the description down below for all of our social links. We've got Instagram, Twitter, and Discord. And if you want to stay up to date with Colin McCrory Dirt, then make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. If you want to help support the channel, make sure to hit the join button and also check out our merch link down in the description. But thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.